How to create a recurring booking series. From the operator screen, set the pickup date and time for the first booking. Enter the pickup. Enter the destination. And any other details that are required for the series. Press F8, enter any vias that are needed. In the recurring field, enter the days in which the booking will dispatch. One being Monday, two for Tuesday, and all the way to seven for Sunday. For this test we will use Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. Set the end date for the series, 31st of May. F1 to save. The two-week operator reminder will appear highlighting in green the days where a booking will dispatch. Click on confirm to save the series. To view a recurring series, click on the pre-booked tab. Set the date picker from and to dates. Each occurrence of the series will be shown individually. The entire series can be edited onwards by right clicking, pressing edit, or selecting one of the bookings and pressing E on the keyboard. An operator alert will then appear to remind the operator that they are editing a booking in a series. Press any key to continue. Make the required change we will change the pickup time, 1500, the driver instruction, and the customer name. F1 to save, and a pop up will appear allowing for the operator to enter a reason for the change. The operator can choose to update only this booking or all bookings. We will click on update all bookings. The two week operator reminder will appear showing the days of dispatch in green. Click Y to confirm. To view the changes, set the date picker. Note that the changes have been applied to all bookings in the series. Any instances in a recurring series can be paused by the operator. To pause an instance in a series, right click and choose edit or select any of the booking instances and press E on the keyboard. The operator will be reminded that this booking is in a recurring series. Press any key to continue. Press F8. Click on the calendar icon to the right of the recurring field. Each of the days where the recurring series is due to run will be shown in green. Days can be paused by clicking and turning the cell pink. We will pause the 20th and the 22nd. Click off the grid when finished. F1 to save. An operator note can be entered for a reason for the change. Click on Update All Bookings, Confirm, Set the Date Picker, and notice that the days in which we paused have now been removed from the series. In the event where recurring bookings will be paused for a set time, for example a school week holiday, an exclusion schedule can be used. The exclusion schedule when applied to the recurring series will stop the recurring bookings from being created for that week. Notice on dispatch our own test series here covers the 18th, the 25th and the 27th. 
we will now create a exclusion schedule which will remove all of the bookings between that uh, for that week to create an exclusion schedule click on admin config schedule exclusions new provide a name and a ref save click on view edit click on calendar exclusion schedules can contain many date ranges and can be applied to many recurring series to add exclusion schedule dates select from the t from the above 18 to 28 add schedule To apply the exclusion schedule, return to the operator screen. Click on the pre booked tab. Set the dates in the date picker. Notice the 18th, 25th, 27th right click edit on the first occurrence get the operator reminder F8 in the scheduled exclusion box enter forward slash choose the scheduled exclusion that we want name holiday F1 to save enter a note update all bookings and confirm Set the date picker. Notice that all the bookings between the 18th and the 28th are now gone. An exclusion schedule can be removed at any time. Once removed, the original bookings will be reinstated. Notice on our test series here the gap between the 15th to the 29th. We will now remove the exclusion schedule. Right click on the first occurrence, click edit. Operator, notice that you're editing a recurring booking. F8, exclusion schedule will be shown. Remove the exclusion schedule. F1 to save. You can enter in an optional reason. Update all bookings. Confirm. Set the date picker. Notice that the 25th and the 27th and the 18th are back. Any booking in the recurring series can be cancelled independently of the other bookings. Take for example on the 13th, either right click and cancel job or select the booking and press X. The operator can supply a reason for cancel. The 13th is then removed. Previously we have edited the entire series. If an edit is performed on a single booking in the series then that booking will be detached from the series. Take the booking on the 18th, right click and edit or select the booking and press E on the keyboard. Operator notice. change name F1 to save supply a reason for the change and then click update this booking only a note then will appear stating that this booking will be detached in the series any key to continue then when the date picker is selected we'll see that this booking now exists on its own. It can be deleted, it can be edited again, and it can be treated as if it was a normal booking, but it is no longer a part of the series. 
And finally, cancelling bookings. Bookings in a recurring series can be cancelled in one of four ways. The first, as we have seen already, is applying an exclusion schedule for a range of dates, e.g. from the 25th to the 29th, those bookings will be removed. The second way, as we have seen already, is to right click or single click and press X on any of the bookings, supply a reason and to cancel. That will remove the booking itself. The third uh, way of removing bookings from a recurring um, series is to change the end date. Click on the first booking, right click, edit, or select it and press E on the keyboard. Press F8. Notice at the bottom, the last booking in the series is on the 29th. If we change the end date to the 28th, F1 to save, we can supply a reason, update all bookings, confirm, select the date picker. Notice that the 29th has been removed. The fourth way of removing bookings at a certain point in a recurring series is to right click on any booking on the 25th, for example, cancel recurring series, supply a reason, and confirm. Notice that bookings on the 25th and beyond have been cancelled, but the bookings beforehand have not.